This video was requested by a viewer after he discovered that aloe vera can grow in water. Also was intrigued because I have never tried this before. Nevertheless, because I have used aloe vera as a rooting hormone, I already have a preconceived notion of what would happen. I have a few videos that demonstrate that aloe vera is not effective as a rooting hormone. I used the Chinensis variety for this video. These plants had undergone a day of air drying after washing. You may have noticed that the gel is clear. This is because I used a blender to liquefy the aloe vera gel and a filter to remove the pulps to make the gel last longer. Because the gel smells so terrible as it spoils, I replace it every 4 days. All of the roots were gone after 3 weeks. Even in the water, things like this occasionally happen. This is due to the fact that aloe vera develops a new kind of root in water, an aquatic root, which is smaller than the typical root. In order to make a comparison, I took one of the plants and placed it in water. I made sure that the root part is submerged in the water similar to those that were placed in the gel. Three more weeks later, the plants that were placed in the aloe vera gel had not produced any roots. whereas the plant in the water had. I'm going to try this again, but next time I'm going to use aloe vera cuttings. I hope you learned something from this video. This is Danny and thank you for watching.